So as you guys can see from the title of this video, you guys know that um, I'm not very keen or high on Conor McGregor as an individual um, or a fighter when it pertains to his stand-up game because I believe that it's a bit overhyped in the UFC. Um, in fact, you know, you know, fuck that. I'm being nice right now. No, the dude's stand-up game is good for those dudes in the MMA. He is about to step in the ring with professionals. I'm along with Paulie Malignaggi. You are being fucking disrespectful. All right? You guys sat here. and You know what? I, I sat here for a couple of days and I just wanted to see what people were going to say. Writing down in videos. People sitting up there. Some. 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 Uh, my brothers and sisters in the LDBC. They have. You know. They keep logic on their hands. Okay. At all times. And this is why I fucks with them. Um, but a lot of you other cats. You are uh, clear, clearly MMA and Conor McGregor fans. Trying to pose as boxing fans. Don't know what the hell you fucking talking about. Conor McGregor is going to get slapped the fuck around the ring. I've watched it. I know you guys have watched it. Stop with this bullshit. You guys have all seen his training footage when he was training for Nate Diaz too. He was getting outworked. And, and the guy was using basic boxing fundamentals and he was outworking him. Conor McGregor is too fucking slow. He's going to stand in the middle of the ring, walk like with that zombie ass positioning, foot positioning, and anybody with half a decent brain can know that you ain't even got to pivot against Conor McGregor and you be able to knock him out in the boxing ring. Stop with this foolishness. When he started getting jabbed to the body in the midsection, when he starts feeling that, when those solar plexus start locking up, when he starts getting the jab in front of his face, when he can't sit there and see, when a f fighter uses a blinding jab, holds the... Uh, holds the the left out to blind him and then shoot the overhand right over the top. This man is, he is garbage, bro. Let's, let's stop this. Let's stop this right now. And, and, and let me dive into something else about Conor McGregor, which I'm going to be completely honest and keep it 100. And I don't think a lot of people want to sit here and touch it. To me, some people want to give Conor McGregor all the credit in the world, right? And if you want to give him credit in the world from a marketing perspective, absolutely 100%. He has... He is earning every dollar he makes from a marketing standpoint. But to me, it's all a facade. And Conor McGregor, to me, I've said it this before, and people don't have to agree with me. They don't even have to like my position on it. The dude is trying to steal and bite our style, period. And, it, and it, 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 he, the very guy you sitting up there talking about how Conor McGregor would knock Floyd Mayweather out, he acts exactly like Floyd Mayweather. I told you guys in the last video I did the breakdown. I said this. I, I, I'm not, listen, I'm not one to shy away from it. I'll keep it 100. I call it like I see it. And when I see dudes trying to bite off of our style, and, and you know by the proverbial our style, you know what I'm talking about. I know a lot of brothers in the LDBC know what I'm talking about. So it is what it is. He can, he can keep this game. He can talk all this all he wants as much as he wants to. Okay, shout out to Dan, Dan the Man Boxing. I just peeped his video where apparently Dana, Dana White is stunned. Listen, man, it, let me tell you something. Conor McGregor, after he beat Nate Diaz the second time, okay, this man, this shit has gone to his head, bro. I keep trying to tell people, this dude thinks he can bring that shit over here in boxing? Get the fuck out. A C-level fighter would beat the brakes off of Conor McGregor.